Bună ziua! Bine ați venit la o lecție de limba engleză pentru clasa a 5 -a din acest manual. Lecția noastră începe pe această pagină și dacă mai avem timp, continuăm și cu pagina următoare. Cine nu are acest manual, vă rog să facă captură de ecran. Meet the animals. Lead in. <coughs> Exercise 1. Match each picture to the words in the box. Camel. Picture B. Sheep. Picture J. Giraffe. Picture E. Bat. Picture A. Monkey. Picture F. Cow. Picture C. Turkey. Picture H. Duck. Picture D. B. Look again at the pictures and say whether the animals are wild or animals. Bats are wild animals. Camel are not wild animals, some of them. <coughs> <coughs> But other camels uh, can be wild animals. Cows are not wild animals. Ducks are not wild birds. Giraffes are wild animals. Monkeys are wild animals. Sheep are wild animals. Turkeys are wild animals. Exercise 2. <coughs> uh, it is written there, listen and take the animals you hear. But... I shall tell you all the animals, okay? Lion, repeat. Lion, cat, frog, snake, fly, wolf, dolphin, horse, gorilla. Exercise number three. Guess the animal. Dog. Camel, horse, kangaroo, mouse. Number one. This animal lives in Australia. It is big and very strong and can jump very high. The mother keeps her baby in a pouch. This is kangaroo. Number two. This animal is small. It lives in people's houses. Some people are afraid of it, but cats are not. <coughs> This can be cat. Number three. This animal is quite big. It is usually brown, but it can also be black, white or gay. It helps farmers to work in the fields. You can ride on it too. Uh, it is, let's say, cow. Or no, horse. It is horse. Yes, sorry. It is horse. Number four. This uh, animal is uh, big. It can walk long distances in very hot weather without drinking any water for a long period of time. It is the camel. <coughs> Number five. This animal lives in people's houses or around them. It barks and people enjoy having one as a pet. Cats are sometimes their enemies. Dog. Exercise number four. Match the animals to their natural habitat. 
Who lives in the desert? Let's see. Camel. Um, and scorpion. Who lives in the forest? Squirrel. <coughs> bear. Chimpanzee. Fox. And tiger. Who lives in the jungle? Tiger. Um, and chimpanzee. Who lives in the ocean? Ah, and in the jungle also lives lizard. And lizard lives in the forest too. Well, in the ocean lives a dolphin, shark and turtle. Now say where each of them lives as in the example. Camels live in the desert. Lizard lives in the forest and in the jungle. Squirrel lives in the forest. Dolphin lives in the ocean. Camel lives in the desert. Shark lives in the ocean. Bear lives in the forest. Deer lives in the forest. Scorpion lives in the desert and in the jungle. Whale lives in the ocean. Chimpanzee lives in jungle and sometimes in forest. Fox lives in the forest. Turtle lives in the ocean. And tiger lives um, in jungle. <clears throat> Exercise number five. Fill in the right question words, then match the questions to their answers. Number one. What is the name of this animal? Letter B. A kangaroo. Number two, where does it live? Letter C, in Australia. Number three, why does it have a pouch? Letter E, to carry its babies. <coughs> Number four, when does it sleep? Letter A, during the day. Number five, how many legs does it have? Letter D, four. And now, let's um, read this text please be attentive listen to the dialogues customer hello i'm looking for a present for my daughter it's her 10th birthday this weekend what kind of pet are you looking for big or small small how about a parrot it's colorful and talkative. No, they are too messy and noisy. Do you have something that is small and fluffy? A kitten? We already have a Persian cat at home. Something smaller. A hamster then? Our cat may think it's good to eat. A guinea pig? My daughter is going to be delighted. <coughs> This text matches with this photo. Text number one, photo number two. B. Child and mom. We are finally at the zoo. Look at these animals. Mom, what is that bird over there? The one with the long legs and neck? Yes, the one with pink features. 
that's a flamingo. And mom, look, what's that next to the tiger? I can't see. What does it look like? Well, it looks like a really big cat with whiskers, shiny black fur and big paws. That's a very dangerous animal. It is called panther. What does it eat? Meat. We don't have the photo here, the photo of the panther. Look, here it is, the panther. And see, hi Mike, is that your science project? Yes, it's about bats, my favorite animals. They live in caves, you know. What do bats look like? They look like flying mice, really. They are small, covered in fur, with a pair of wings and big ears. What do they eat? They eat a lot of insects. When do they sleep? During the day, mostly. They only go out at night. Why do you like them? Because they are very unusual. We don't know much about their sight, but their hearing is extraordinary. Okay. And now let's do this page. This is the last one. Read the dialogues again and circle the correct answer. Number one, exercise one. Sentence number one, the customer is getting a for her daughter, hamster, cat, guinea pig. Do you remember? Guinea pig is the right answer. So, let her see. The child thinks the looks like a big cat. The correct answer is C, panther. Number three, pets live in cages, caves, or forests. Correct answer is C, is B, caves. 1B, mark the sentence is true, false, or doesn't say. The customer is the in the first dialogue wants a present for his son. False. The customer has already a Persian cat. True. The customer doesn't want to buy a hamster. True. The customer buys an orange guinea pig. Doesn't say if it is orange or other color. 5. The child in the second dialogue likes gorillas. False. 6. The panther is opposite the tiger. False. <coughs> Number seven, the tiger has got brown spots and big paws. <coughs> <coughs> False. Carol is doing a project about bats. True. Bats eat insects. True. Mike has a bat at home. Doesn't say. Exercise 2. Write down the explanation of words in phase in the dialogue. Use a dictionary. Use the words to make sentences. I don't know what words, but it's okay. Exercise 3. Read and match. Mammals, insects, reptiles, birds. A. They are cold-blooded animals. Some of them have four eggs and some haven't got any. Reptiles. B. They have got a pair of legs and a pair of wings. They have got features and most of them can fly. Birds. Number four. C. They can be big or small. They have babies and feed them with milk. Mammals. 1. D. 
They are small. Many have three pairs of legs and some have two pairs of wings. Insects. <clears throat> and now the vocabulary practice. Say which of these are mammals, reptiles, insects or birds. Ladybirds, insect. Lion, mammal. Butterfly, insect. Duck, bird. Deer, mammal. Spider, insect. Snake, reptile. Hen, bird. Parrot, bird. Alligator, reptile. Mosquito, insect, dolphin, mammal, dragonfly, insect, whale, mammal, turkey, bird, donkey, mammal, lizard, mammal, no, lizard is reptile, sorry, turtle, <coughs> reptile, shark. Uh, mammal, kangaroo mammal, camel mammal, pigeon, bird, penguin, bird. Exercise number five. Watch the video and label each picture using the words below. Kittens, calves, foals, ducklings, puppies, lambs, cubs, chicks. In picture one we see... Calves. In picture two, chicks. In picture three, kittens. In picture four, ducklings. In picture five, foals. In picture six, kittens. In picture seven, uh, lambs. And in picture eight, puppies. Fill in, cats have kittens, horses have foals, dogs have puppies, sheep have uh, lambs, hens have chicks, ducks have ducklings, cows have calves, tigers have kittens, or cubs, cubs, tigers have cubs. Mulțumesc pentru participare. Dacă v-a plăcut lecția, vă rog să lăsați un like și dacă doriți să mai lucrăm împreună la limba engleză gratuit, ca și până acum, vă rog să vă abonați voi și să le spuneți și altora despre acest canal. Această înregistrare am făcut-o la After School Joyful. La revedere!